Hey there. Don't be shy. Whoa. Ulan, we need to ask you for a favor. I stopped accepting commissions a long time ago. Sorry, you two, but you'll just have to ask another adventurer. Oh, yeah. it's not that kind of favor. It's just a teeny tiny thing. <laughs> you smell great. <laughs> wow. Just wow. <laughs> I'm just going to assume that you're either joking or being sarcastic. <laughs> oh, man. To be fair, I put a lot of effort into my appearance for someone who spends all their time in the great outdoors. But I smell great? Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> anyway, this is a pointless conversation. If you want to know about perfume, try talking to Chi Ming. All right. The fortune teller, right? Paimon remembers she smells pretty good. Okay, now we're just out here smelling people in public. <laughs> what? Hello, how may I help? We've come to I gotta smell you. <laughs> Another one? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! I don't want to do it, but I I'm pretty curious. Actually, no, I want to do it. I'm pretty curious. Uh, I. Sorry, you caught me off guard. Most people aren't so direct. Right. I think we need more time to get to know each other. Yo, let's go. Uh, we just wanted to know what perfume you normally use. Paimon, shut the hell up. Oh, <laughs> well, I don't actually use any. While we're on the subject, have you never heard anyone mention Ying Ar's homemade perfume? Ying Air? Oh, as in scent of spring, Ying Air? Yes, that's her. Many a rich family's daughter has gotten her to make perfume for them. Apparently, her homemade product is better than anything you'll find on the market. Great! This is just the intel we need! Finally, we're getting somewhere! I think I cracked the secret to uh, flirting with people. You just gotta tell them that they smell great. Use this one trick and everyone will fall in love with you. Dr. Zayden, time for the smell test. Well, hello. You found me at last. I've been waiting for you. Waiting for what? you? Alright, this you is definitely coming? going somewhere. Actually, I was starting to worry you wouldn't find me. This is the ultimate test of my appeal, after all. Relax. I know why you're here. You want to get your hand on my homemade perfume, don't you? What exactly. kind would you like? Whichever one you're wearing. <laughs> I'm not wearing any, darling. Could it be that you've been bewitched by my natural scent? If so, I'm afraid it's one of a kind. <sighs> Whatever this is, you guys need to snap out of it right now! <laughs> Under the silk flowers! Three in one go! My goodness. You have extreme tastes for someone your age. FBI, open up! <laughs> Maybe the rumors I heard were true after all. You're on the prowl and need some sweet-smelling ammunition? Is that it? Yes, it's for Rex Lapis. Uh, is that the best you could come up with? Even if you were genuinely offering perfume to a deity, that doesn't explain why you'd need three kinds. Sorry, your story just doesn't hold water. Zhang Li was right. People don't remember this tradition anymore. As one of my favorite poems goes, O oh, cherry tree, begrudge not thy blossoms as they are deflowered in the spring, for come winter, even thy sturdiest wood shall wither. That went over Paimon's head a little. <laughs> in short, I'm happy to help. Traveler, you can be my assistant, but you'd better make sure I'm the only person on your mind while you're hanging out. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> All right, I guess we're going somewhere with this. So, where is a good place for making sweet, sweet perfume? My goodness, dude, her voice, it's so sus. Her tone of voice is so sus. Somewhere closer to home will do. Let's go for the kitchen at Wan Min Restaurant. The kitchen, all right, so this is a date now? First Lisa, now this. 
Okay. I've had a word with Chef Mao. We can start work now. Are you ready to please me? <laughs> Yo, better make me what act up. What did you say? Exactly. I meant make me proud, as my assistant, obviously. While I'm setting up, you can go and fetch some water. All right. Iron stomachs. Oh, okay, let's go back over here. You didn't let me finish. Grab the water. Let's go all the way back. You got the water. This water will do nicely. Now, I need you to extract the silk flower essence using a crafting bench. Perfume making uses an altogether different technique from alchemy. Here, let me teach you. Very carefully, take hold of the mortar and pestle. Gently does it. You need to keep your wrist firm so your hand doesn't slip. All right, easy. Now use your strong hand to stir it with a persistent rhythm. Keep going until the juices start <laughs> to come out. I'm gonna try to go for all the unusual dialogues just for this mission. Ooh, you're a natural, like a fish to water. Mm-hmm. Now take these and try it out on your own using a nearby crafting bench. Don't forget to do all three. They look visually identical during the essence extraction process, but I will put them into separate containers when the perfume is ready. We've gone from killing monsters to going on a date now, all of a sudden for the second time. Here we go, got your perfume. Wow, this is some exquisite silk flower essence. On to the next stage, the most important one of all. The essence is placed into water and simmered over a low heat until most of the water has boiled off. You must take care to control the heat during this process. If the temperature goes too high, it will affect the scent. So please, focus on controlling the heat. This is the final step. Don't waste a drop of that essence now. We want all of it in there. <laughs> all three perfumes are ready. And you, my friend, were a wonderful assistant. A testament to the lengths Thank you will you. go to for romance. It's so rare to see nowadays. <laughs> um, I was thinking of you this whole time. Let's go for it. Wow, you actually remembered my throwaway comment. You know, you're cuter than people give you credit for. If I didn't have my guard up, I can see how easily one could be taken in. Yo! Anyway, shall I give you a brief overview of each scent? It might just help you match the right scent to the right occasion. Paima wants to hear this. This first one is sweet as candy, straight out of a fairy tale. Younger women will love it. The second one is for those with more refined tastes, the first choice for daughters of high society. Finally, the third one has a soft but lingering scent, like a mist that captures the last light of dusk. Mature women adore this one. All clear? Don't get them mixed up now. You'll ruin the mood. I, I think I got it. <laughs> Good. Be sure to come visit if you ever need help with anything, okay? No, I'm <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> come and hang out with me at Scent of Spring sometime, okay? Oh, I will. I mean, um, uh, not, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just gonna finish my mission now. So we've gone on two dates so far. I see this as an absolute win. <laughs>